All right, so now what we want to do is we want to cut a heart out of plastic canvas. And to do that, I have picked up a five mesh um, long piece of plastic canvas. And this is a 13.6 by 21.6. This will make two hearts. So you can buy this in your needlework section of Hobby Lobby or Joann's. And then what I did was I cut it in half. So this is half of that piece. I'm just gonna remove the sticker because I don't need it. And I'm gonna come down to the bottom corner. We're actually gonna cut our heart so that it looks like this. And the measurements um, will be in the blog post so you don't have to write these down as we go. Um, but what we're basically gonna do is we're gonna count the squares and make some marks with our Sharpie. So the first thing we're gonna do is count up 29. So one, two, three, seven, 20, 29. And we're gonna make a mark. This is 29 squares up, two squares over, and then we're gonna go 10 squares up. So make a mark. We're just going in one this time. And now we're gonna go up five. One, two, three, four, five. And we're gonna make a mark. And this is just kind of our, our ending point here. And so far we've been doing straight lines, straight lines, straight lines. Now we're gonna go on the diagonal. This is gonna make a part of the hump of the heart at the top. So on the diagonal, we're gonna go over nine squares, counting this one that we just finished off. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we're gonna make a little block here. This is nine squares, and we're cutting on the diagonal here. So then the next thing we're gonna do is 11 over. We're gonna make a mark here. This is our 11 straight across there. Again, we're gonna do diagonal and we're doing the same uh, number. We're gonna do nine, so one. And if you look at it, this is the first section of our heart. It kinda goes like that. Then we're gonna do 14 straight down to the center. So one, two, three, 13, 14. All right. So this is the center of our heart. If we run down this line, it should come right down to the center of where we're working. And we're gonna do the same thing on this side. We're gonna do the same numbers, 29 over two, up 10 over one, up five, nine on the diagonal, 11 over, nine on the diagonal, and then 14 to the center. All right, so you can see from the other side, I've done the same measurement all the way around. I've got my last nine diagonal. And if you've done it correctly, when you mark down your 14, it should meet right in the center with your other line. So this will be the 14 mark, and I'm just gonna trace it right down here. And you should have a complete heart. So now what I'm going to do is I'm gonna cut this heart out um, using my sharp scissors. If you've never cut plastic canvas before, what you're trying to do is cut as close to the original line without cutting through any of the plastic in this box because we're keeping the heart and all of the outside here is waste. So we're gonna cut nice and close in both of these lines and then I'm gonna come in these three lines and cut down this long line. And again, I don't wanna cut any of the heart. I'm just cutting on the outside of the heart. I wanna cut it nice and close so that I have a pretty clean edge and not a bunch of little tiny bumpy pieces of plastic. So nice and clean edge. And then again, I'm gonna, it's just easier to cut down on these pieces and we don't need these long pieces. So we're just gonna trim those away, cut nice and close to my line without cutting through the plastic. And then once I get to the diagonal, I'm actually cutting right through the square on the outside. So snip, snip, you're cutting this diagonal. You wanna make sure not to cut into this square at all, otherwise you're gonna have an open square and it'll be difficult to tie uh, or loop anything around the outside. You may not need to loop anything around the outside, but it's just best to keep it complete if you can. Straight down this side. Nice and easy. And then again, on the diagonal, we're cutting on the 
right through the square, making sure to keep this side nice and tacked. Down a nice straight line here, nice and close. We don't want any little bits or as much as we can take off the plastic without hurting the integrity of the heart. What you're left with then is the template to tie all of your pom-poms on. So here's the heart shape that we cut out of plastic canvas. One more thing that we need to cut from our plastic canvas is a just a tiny piece of plastic canvas that we're gonna actually tie onto the back of the heart in order for the ribbon uh, that we're gonna hang our heart with can go through it and kind of hold it into place. So we need to cut a four by 13. It's four this way, 13 this way. And we're just gonna use the scrap of the piece. I actually have one cut already, so I'm just gonna use it to mark my corners here where I need to cut. And it's just a square cut, so we're just gonna cut straight up this side, nice and close, but not cutting into the piece. And then I'm gonna cut straight down this side. And we're gonna use this, again, just to put into the back. And I'm gonna use the edge with the uh, Sharpie on it as the back. So we're gonna place it in here and I'm gonna tie it into place with some of the pom-poms. So now we're gonna to get to pom-pom placement. 